Where do I start? <laughs> Planning this whole wedding during a pandemic. The craziest thing I think I've ever done. I found boxes of first CDs Trying to get my office clean Took ten years of folks giving them to me Till I sat down What a great day this has turned out to be We actually have something to celebrate in 2020 So that's <laughs> nice Some of you may or may not know But Brenna is a NICU nurse And she takes care of tiny humans for a living And that really says a lot about her she puts others before herself. She's so kind and her presence is like a breath of fresh air and she brings sunshine into any room she enters. And when she met Will, she radiated it. <laughs> They're just dreaming of some life out on the road. He's uh, always been more of a brother to me than ever a friend. For as long as I can remember, we've been together. Um, and through that entire time, he's never really changed. I mean, yeah, he's grown to six foot four, 300 pounds, and he's now known as the bearded wonder. But uh, he's always been the same giant, friendly, loving, honorable, straight down, straight down, good American guy. Looks different now than she does right there, but that's how it goes. As for the rest. When Iowa State football was starting, and she called me and said, Mom, you need to come to the game and meet Will and his parents. The parents always go and meet the players after the game. So we went, and here comes Will out the door, this huge bearded guy. <laughs> And I'm standing back there just kind of watching, and he greets his mom, gives her a big hug, greets his dad, gives him a big hug, greets Brenda, gives her a big hug, and then he looks at me, and he spreads his arms and goes, that must be mama. And They're just dreaming of some life out on the road. Oh, thank God for boxes, first CDs, yeah. Babe, I, after everything said and done, I just I want to let you know how much I, I love you. And I'm so happy to spend the rest of my life with you. And having two days, it's, it's such a, an awesome experience. You know, we've, we've been through a lot. I'm so excited that that day is finally here, or this day is finally here. Um, it seemed like forever. I mean, two years engaged, man. Like, it's a long freaking time. I'm just really excited to live the rest of my life with you. And I love you so much. I can't wait to see you in a couple minutes and finally get to say our ideas for the second time. <laughs> this is craziness, but I'm so excited. So excited. I know you gotta be cold. Oh my <laughs> god. You look so beautiful. Thank you. Hi baby. Hi. You look so pretty. I'm Thank so you. happy. You, know. you have your bow tie on? Oh no. <laughs> I know, it's like 
can't even see it. I know. Thank you all for being here. Uh, honestly, I think I'm the most nervous uh, <laughs> between these two. They're not nervous. They love each other. They already know they're, you know, they're a couple. They're married. They're they're forever. Like uh, there's no pressure for them. <laughs> I just don't want to look stupid too late, right? Too late. Will, do you promise to love Brenna in good times and in bad times? When life seems easy and when life seems hard? When, life, when love is simple and when it takes effort? Do you promise to adore her and respect her all the days of your life? I do. Sweet. <laughs> Brenna, do you promise to love Will in good times and in bad times, when life seems easy and when it seems hard, when love seems simple and when you have to put effort into it, do you promise to cherish him and respect him all the days of your life? I do. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and pronounce these people right here. <laughs> Guys, my cousins, my family, my family, Will and Brenna, Lifetime of happiness. As the two of you have agreed to live together in matrimony, have promised your love for each other by the vows that you have given, by the rings you have exchanged, and by joining hands. I now declare you, husband and wife, you may kiss your bride. Okay, all right. Pronounce your man and wife. Will and Brenna, kiss the bride. because they have a, a good past behind them, both of them do. And finally now I have a son, and that's pretty special too. So please raise your glasses and toast Brennan William to a strong, loving, and committed marriage. Oh, oh, oh.